So today is a very exciting day because today is the 1st of July but when you're watching this it probably be a bit later. Today is the day of Pink Dot. So yeah, uh, I haven't been to Pink Dot before but I've heard so much about it and um, I know it's a bit of a controversial thing but uh, I don't really care because you know I have friends in the LGBT community and they're no different from all of us so I don't really care. So I thought you know it'd be it would be fun to experience Pink Dot and go there, you know, have fun and and show some support to my friends who are in the LGBT community because, you know, it's, it's kind of annoying when people be like, oh, you're queer, so, you know, you get treated differently, which I think it's, which I think is not very nice. So anyway, yeah, I thought I'd bring you guys along with me to celebrate Pink Dot. Do you celebrate Pink Dot? Is it a celebration? Well, it's an event. So anyway, I thought I'd bring you guys along with me to Pink Dot. So, let's go! So I'm currently back home. It's currently 2am because my friend and I decided to go out and meet a few other friends right off the pink dot. Um, we kind of didn't, um, how shall I say, we didn't really get to experience the full festivities of pink dot. Kind of went in a bit late around, we met around 6ish. So by then the queue was crazy and it was you know, um, it was at max capacity so they didn't let us in and I was hoping they would let us in um, you know, during the dot formation where you know, you kind of like shine the lights and all that and you know, everyone can see us from outer space but um, I think because there was like tight, tighter security this year I'm not really sure what um, what the rules are There's, it's a lot more strict I think so like we have bag checks and ID checks and everything so that definitely slowed the queue down and um, by the time we got there, it's just so crowded. So we were like queuing for about an hour or so which kind of really sucks because you can kind of hear what's going on but you literally just 
cannot see anything because all you see is just like people in pink but um yeah so anyway we didn't get to go in the saddest part was that i got we got to ex we didn't even get to experience the um what they call the dot formation which is what the you know the that light up thing where they hold the flashlights and be like whoa um yeah so we got to ex we didn't experience it we just got to see it while we were having our bags checked so right at the bag check the host was like lift your lights up and we were like well guess we missed the dot formation and everything else that meant pink dot so like yeah i guess we missed everything that was significant to pink dot kind of but we kind of roamed around for a bit just to like you know have a look see look see but everything was just gone by then i mean it was dark that's one thing um the performances were over the shops were more or less closed so honestly we kind of went there for nearly nothing which kind of sucked because i was hoping i'd get to you know sit on the grass and like i don't know enjoy the performances and all but you know i'm gonna go again next year hopefully i'll get to go next year with like more friends and you know apparently going in a bigger group is more fun which i guess so because it was just me and my friend and both of us were just like oh dear the queue is long so i don't know i just thought <sighs> just such a waste i guess i don't know and it was just really hot it was just really really hot my skin was just going crazy so i i didn't want to wait the moment i got home i just wanted to take all that makeup off so hence the bare face but yeah um i definitely want to go again next year just to you know attempt to really really experience pink dot you know i want to see everything that goes on and all that i mean that will be fun you know i think that was my biggest regret about this event that i didn't um take the advice that was given on the facebook page and go at 3 p.m although the actual performances just started at 6. yeah i don't know <sighs> but anyway um i know this vlog wasn't really what um well the vlog wasn't really what i expected it to be or what i hoped for it to be i don't know maybe like i don't know i just really wanted to enjoy pink dot and i didn't get to so i'm just really really bummed about it but on the bright side um i did meet my friend ashley for a short moment and she gave me the flashlight so that's really cool i think it shines pink if i'm not wrong like i don't know if you can see it it kind of shines pink yeah don't want to blind you guys so i'm not going to do that and she passed me a shirt as well which i will probably photograph and post on social media as i do with things yeah so anyway yeah probably quite a short vlog or more of a chatty ish sort of vlog hope you guys don't mind but anyway i hope you guys are having a good start to july and i'll see you in my next vlog